So today I'm going to be making uh, large hinges, so I'm going to be laser cutting holes in these. But first I'm going to cut a fixture out of this steel plate here, and then uh, cut the holes in the hinges, and then I'm going to press in some hardware. So it's going to change the bed from the outside to the inside. The head's going to come down and measure the sheet and then cut the fixture. So this measurement basically allows for the misalignment of the sheet and it will adjust the program accordingly. I'm just going to put the hinges in the slot. Now the holes are oversized, so the uh, laser doesn't weld the hinge to the sheet. And I'm just going to use some tape. If I were making more than four of these, then I would uh, use some toggle clamps. And the reason the tape is needed at all is because the gas flow will actually pop the hinge out of the, uh, the sheet. Now the table is going to bring the outside sheet back in. Now the head's going to come down and measure the sheet and cut the hinges. It does this, there's a uh, there's a capacitive sensor in the head that helps with measuring the sheet. press this hardware in and uh, these are pen nuts and they basically get pressed in with a machine like this. This is a small hydraulic press and it has a, you can either choose to be conductive or non-conductive. Conductive is nice because if I, I, you know, it won't let you hit your fingers and uh, the pen nuts get pressed in and it's a nice way because you can have a steel or a stainless thread in a you know thin aluminum sheet metal. And we use these a lot for all kinds of applications, different enclosures and stuff like that. So hope you guys like the video. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.